Hey guys, so today I'm going to show you how to make this 4th of July herbal. It's really cute and simple to make. I wanted to resemble the flag. So we're going to start with the ribbons. I'm using blue, white, red, and one with stars and glitter. Here are the sizes of each ribbon and the width. So you can check it out. You can pause it so you can get more time with them. And I'm going to go ahead and start with this. What I'm going to do is try to resemble the flag like I mentioned already. But for that I need to heat seal all the ends of my ribbon because I don't want this fraying while you're like well the girl the little girl is using it or while making it. So I'm just gonna heat seal everything really good and I'm gonna start gluing the bow the ribbons this way. I'm just gonna add two stripes of red on the white one. That way it's going to resemble the stripes on the flag and I'm going to go ahead and hot glue. You can use any glue you want. I just had this on hand and it was easier for me to use that. So I'm going to go ahead and finish this ribbon and I'm going to do the same with the blue. In the blue I have three stripes of uh, stars ribbon in blue which it's actually pretty cute because it resembles the... Uh, the stars on the flag so i'm gonna go ahead and do the same thing i did with the red one i'm gonna glue them in there and since i already have this one i'm gonna mark the middle like i always do with all my ribbons just be careful because we use hot glue we don't want it melting in here so i'm going to take the ends and i'm gonna bring them into the middle this way and it's gonna form an eight shape ribbon so I'm gonna just put a pin in the middle to hold everything together while I'll figure it out where the blue stripe is going to go. So I'm gonna pinch this way, that way I can measure where I'm gonna glue the blue stripe. And I forgot to heat seal this, so let me do it really quick. So I go back here and I'm just trying to figure it out if it will be the center and I'm just gonna glue it and uh, or you can just hold it like that and glue it at the end it's up to you but uh, I think it will be better if you glue this is a, a bow that is gonna be like really firm because all the glue you're using it's um, it's gonna have a different texture but it's gonna be so cute with the white dress or the four July red dress it's gonna be perfect and it's pretty simple to make you won't spend a lot of money making a bow like this and I don't know I really like it so I hope you like this idea too and I'm just gonna finishing finish gluing the stars this way and I already have the uh, the thread ready because we're gonna hold this I actually had to to take a little bit of the blue because it was over Ha the half part and it was gonna show on the other side and I didn't want that but it was okay because it was gonna be covered with the with the center ribbon so it didn't matter much so as you can see this is what I have now so I'm gonna start folding the centers like this and I'm just gonna form my bow I'm just gonna crunch the center until I have a bow looking terrible <laughs> if it makes sense and I'm gonna go ahead and get my thread and hold everything together because this is the, the bow. You can actually leave it like this if you want just a simple herbal. But I'm gonna add some spikes. That way it's a little bit bigger and it looks nicer. So I'm just gonna make sure that everything is in place here. That it's not gonna fall apart. Just make sure because we're using a lot of glue in this so just make sure that you really hold everything tight that way it's gonna last longer and it's gonna look so cute so i'm just gonna do a couple of knots here and i'm gonna go ahead and remove the pin don't forget that part because you don't want a pin in your hair bows and now i'm gonna add the center ribbon that i have i'm just gonna sew it in here and you can use any other color you can use white you can use red you can use the blue i decided to go with the blue because i thought it was gonna look nice so that's why i'm using it here and as you can tell you can already see the flag 
uh, I don't know I really I think this is a really cute bow and it's gonna work perfect for the celebrations so now for the spikes you know they're pretty simple just arrange your ribbon the way you think they look better the way they're gonna pop out more and just use the ribbon the way you want it the way you like it so I'm just gonna go ahead and put everything here together and get ready to sew it and glue it into my main bow so I'm just gonna glue everything here and just like, arrange it the way you want and on the back don't forget to put the other ribbon so you can hold it the barrette so let me just finish this up and show you what it looks like as we're pretty much done so just I'm playing around with how I want the ribbon to um, the bow to look like and this is the end I hope you like this video thank you so much for watching don't forget to subscribe and if you like this video share it with your friends I will talk to you next time bye